This is the Jeff Kai's Auto Sports Desk. It may be 1025 at night, but it is a beautiful day as Bono is singing here in the Visions Veterans Memorial Arena as the Black Bears are your 2023-2024 FPHL Commissioner Cup champion. And I am joined by the Director of Public Relations and Broadcasting, Brooks Hill. Brooks, it is a celebration behind me. I know, probably lost for words, but how you feeling right now? Uh, my voice is a little shot. You know, it didn't look good down 2 nothing in the first period, but the guys rattled off four unanswered goals. The sellout crowd was absolutely amazing. And Binghamton, you know, accomplished the mission tonight. That's what they talked about the entire year. Winning the cup, getting to that next level. And I think they proved a lot of naysayers wrong tonight. You mentioned Binghamton, not just the town, not just the team, but the city here, still here celebrating. What does this win mean for the Southern Tier? It's incredible. 51 years of professional hockey, and this is the first time that the pro team has won the championship in this building. There's a lot of history here. You can look around, look up at our ceiling, see all the division champions joining the b Sins with the Calder Cup. It's going to be a great honor. And hopefully there's a lot more in the next 51 years coming up soon. Well, 51 years is a long time, but this weekend I know is going to be a celebration. What's coming up? How can the city celebrate with their Black Bears? Yeah, so there's going to be a celebration Monday. Uh, I know people probably want to do it this weekend, but Mother's Day, graduation, we're going to do it Monday. All the details are still being finalized, but if you follow the Black Bears on social media, that's your best bet to find out the information. Sign up for the text alerts, email, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, all that. We're going to blast it out so everybody knows what's going on. Brooks, thank you so much. Go celebrate. Go enjoy the Black Bears, your 2023-2024 FPHL champions, but not the only team in the city in postseason play right now. The Binghamton Bearcats taking care of business in lacrosse and softball. We had to earlier this afternoon and all of the highlights from Binghamton. Bearcat faithful in New Haven for the first historic program. First BU hanging with the Bulldogs for the entirety of the first quarter. Christian Scheidel here scoring the first NCAA goal in program history. Bearcats and Bulldogs even at one. Scheidel again a few plays later would put another one in the back of the net. BU down just 3-2 to two after the first. Yale would start to pull away though in the second. Bulldogs going on a six goal run before Emma Blashmi answers. And then off the set play, senior Madison Murphy puts a cap on her Binghamton career with a goal in NCAA play. The Bearcats season comes to an end, but not before setting program best for wins and longest consecutive winning streak. A well round of applause deserved for the 2024 Binghamton Bearcats. BU softball taking on top seed U Albany in the America East semis. Top two, top first, two on for Emma Lawson. That stays just inside the line. Lindsey Walter comes around from second to get the Bearcats on the board. Bottom three now, U Albany up a run. Deanna Grack gets one past Shelby Carvalho at third. That plates a run for the Danes. U Albany would score four times in the third inning. Bearcats down six to two, threatening in the seventh. Bases loaded, tying run at the plate. Brianna Santos brings one run in here with the sack fly. And then on the next batter, Brianna Roberts, she would bring in another with the fielder's choice. Not enough, though. As Binghamton falls to the Dane, AE tournament, double elimination. Bearcats back on the diamond at four. That's going to do it here for us at 10. A huge congratulations to the Binghamton Black Bears. We are so excited for this win. We're so excited to celebrate them on Monday. Thank you again for joining us here on the CW. We have more news for you at 11, so make sure you stick around. Have a great night.